Hi, I'm Judy. I'm a member of Glitter Plus. Today I'm going to be teaching Answer by ATs. I'm following Sun pretty much through the most of the dance, but if sometimes he's in the back and it's hard to see him, I pretty much just follow whoever's in front. They mostly do the same thing. Um, yeah, let's get started. Alright, so you're actually going to be starting on the three of the chorus, which is really weird, but basically on the one, two, they're like walking around or not really doing anything, unless you're uh, Song Hua who does his solo, but everyone else just kind of stands still or moves around. Then on the three, you're going to step out onto your left foot and slide your right foot behind. At the same time, your hands are coming here. So left hand is bent at your hip, and then your right hand is out with your hand flat to the ground. This is three. On four and, you're going to step right, left. So you can come right foot behind and then left foot out. Then on the four and up, you're going to bring your hands up to prep for the five, where you're going to kick your right leg out to the side and then that's going to initiate you to bring your left leg up and then bring it over. So it's not really like a b-boy move where it's like boom boom, but it's more like a right left and then you land over that way. And at the same time your hands are hitting down. So this is five and six. On the and you're going to step out onto your right foot and bring your left hand to your chest and your right hand out. So this is and seven. You have all that time to milk in and on the eight and you're going to bring your hands up and then down. And as you come down, your right knee is going to pop up. So all together, this is five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, and a five, six, and seven, eight, and. All right, so you just finished on the eight and, you're right here. On the one, you're going to step out. So basically, you're jumping with your right foot behind and your left foot out, and you can kind of land on your heel. Um, at the same time, your hands are coming like here. So you're kind of hitting right here and then slowly milking it. So that'll look like eight and one. And then on two, you're switching. And then, so basically your right leg is in front, left leg is back, left, le left hand is up running. Then on the and, you're gonna jump together. Then on the three, you're gonna jump again, this time face forward a little bit. And during this jump, you're gonna swivel your knees around to the right and then your hips and chest will follow so that you're facing this diagonal at the end. So that'll look like two and three. Then on the four, you're going to jump one more time and do a body roll up. So that section, this is five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, and three, four. Then on five, six, you're going to be doing the same thing. So jumping with your left foot in front, right foot in back, right hand is coming forward. Then on six, switch. Then on the end, you're going to bring your top onto your right foot and bring your left foot up. Then seven, you're going to bring your right foot up and then step over with your right foot and bring your left foot up. Then on eight, you're going to jump out, bring your hand all the way up and bring yourself in and bring your hand down. And then the one, you're just jumping out again and bringing your right hand to your chest. And you're kind of pointing at your shoulder. So all together, this is five. Six, seven, eight, and one, two, and three, four, five, six, and seven, eight, and one. Alright, so you just finished on the eight and one. On the two, you're gonna start dragging your right foot in. So this is two, three, on four, and you're gonna step right, left to reset yourself to the center. And then you're gonna also bring your hand up here. Then on five, six, you're going to be turning your wrist forward a little bit, so basically like so. At the same time, your head is going to be isolating outwards. This is five, six. Then on seven, eight, you're going to step back onto your right foot and bring your left hand up to your right shoulder, and then back onto your left foot and bring your right hand up to your left shoulder. So all together, this is five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. All right, so we just ended on the seven, eight. Now on the one, two, you're just kicking onto your, you're stepping, jumping onto your right foot as your left foot kicks out in a really big leg circle. Um, so basically you, from here, this is one, two. It's a little hard to do without getting momentum and like speed for the dance, but it'll, it'll help if you practice it like at the speed of the video. Um, but basically after that, you have three, four, five to just do whatever you want. They all just kind of stand there. Then on six and seven, you're going to jump on your right foot three times. That's six and seven. At the same time, you're just going one, two, three with your hand, like right here. So this is six and seven. Then on eight and you're going to step down with your left foot and bring your hands down. 
and then you're going to turn your hands upwards into your into fists as you bring your left foot up. So all together, this is five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eighty and. All right, so you just end up on the 80 and. So on the one, two, three, you're gonna be stepping forward onto your left foot really aggressively, and then your right foot is gonna follow on the and. So this will be one, and, two, and, three, and. At the same time, your hands are gonna be coming forward and across, out, and then forward again, this time kind of like you're driving and like holding a steering wheel. And each time your hand can also kind of drag your body along. So imagine yourself punching and then your body following. So from A, E, and, this is one, two, three. Then on four, you're gonna step onto your left foot again, but then you're gonna come down. Then on and, you're gonna come up and cross your hands and step, have your weight back on your right foot. And then on the five and six and, you're gonna step left, bring your hands out into these bottom right angles and pick your right leg up and switch to the other side and cross your hands six and do it again then on seven eight you're going to jump into this position your legs are bent arms are out to these 45 degree angles and you're going to be facing slightly to this left diagonal and you're pelvic thrusting on the seven and eight and so all together this is five six seven eighty and one two three four five and six and seven eight and all right, so you just finished on the seven, eight, and on the one you're gonna step back onto your left foot, your hand's gonna come down here. So your left hand is coming to your right shoulder with your palm facing outwards, and then your right arm is coming out to the side. At the same time, you're gonna pick up your right foot and turn and look at the back with your head. So this is one, come back up on and, two, do the same thing to the other side. So hands are in the same position, and you're looking this way, and you're picking up your left foot, Three, one more time. Three, this time you're just gonna bring your foot down on the and, and on the four you're gonna bring your leg up and you're gonna turn it around and that's gonna initiate a jump. So it'll be like boom, boom. So as you bring your leg up, that'll bring your body into this jump and you land towards the right side. Your hands can kinda just smack down and follow yourself around. From here, on, your, on the five, you're gonna step forward onto your left foot and your hands can come right hand up six step in with your left onto your right on and bring your right foot in seven you're gonna step backwards with your left foot and uh, wave your hands twice like so so seven and eight you're bringing your left foot in and right foot out once again so all together this is five six seven and eight and one two three four and five six seven eight all right so you just finished on the seven eight now on the one you're going to step back onto your right foot and turn around on two you're going to step in with your left foot and jump and then you kind of have a choice you can either spin the other way or keep spinning the same way i like to spin the other way because i think it makes it a little more dynamic so i step out onto your my left foot again and then jump with my right foot on three, four. So all together with the counts, this is five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four. On five, you're landing. On and six, you can bring your hand up and then do like come here twice, five and six. Then seven, eight, you're doing this again, seven, eight, and. Then on the one, two, you're gonna step onto your right foot, bring your left foot around and come down three, four, then on five, come back up, and you basically walk for the rest of the course. So all together, this is five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, and six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, now let's do counts from the beginning. This is five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four and five, six and seven, eight and one, two and three, four, five, six and seven, eight and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, 
six and seven, eighty and one, two, three, four, five and six and seven, eight and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five and six, seven, eight and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight.